The Pulsifier 2 is a revolutionary technology for processing food samples for microbiological examination. It's designed to send high-frequency vibrations to drive microbes into suspension. In this video, you will see a simple step-by-step -step guide on how to use the Pulsifier 2. Add 225 milliliters of diluent to a Pulsifier bag. The diluent used is dependent on the analysis being required. Then add 25 grams of sample into the Pulsifier bag containing the diluent. Sample size and diluent volumes can vary. However, we recommend the maximum volumes and quantities to be 225 milliliters diluent and 25 grams of sample. Ensure the Pulsifier is plugged in and powered on from the switch at the back of the machine. Next, simply open the Pulsifier 2 door. Place the bag so that it fits within the Pulsification ring. Ensure the bag placed is free of air. Allow the top of the bag to remain outside of the Pulsifier 2 door. Ensure it's fairly loose and close. The Pulsifier has four buttons. The play button allows you to start the standard 15-second pulsifying process. The stop button allows you to stop the cycle at any point. The pause button allows you to pause the process at any point. And the forward button allows you to choose the alternative extended 30-second program. There are two programs available to choose from. You can either select P1, which is a 15-second cycle, or P2, which is a 30-second cycle. P2 is commonly used when low microbial yields may be expected. Once you are happy with your desired setup, you can run the cycle. You will notice the action of the machine reduces bag bursting. It's quieter than previous models and is designed to be easy to clean, keeping your lab work efficient and effective. Once your sample is finished processing, the Pulsifier bag can be removed from the instrument. Incubate the bag for 24 hours. Samples can then be subcultured onto appropriate media. The Pulsifier 2 by Microgen Bioproducts. The Pulsifier is acknowledged for its application as part of the ISO regulations for the microbial testing of food.